Welcome back everybody to another episode of Inside the Crosshairs. I'm Seth and I'm Jay and we got a good video for you today. We brought that Emperor Scorpion from SIG out here to the range and we're gonna put some 45s down range. Let's see what she can do. Let's do some work. Roger that. Alrighty guys, first we're going to put some aluminum rounds through it and see how they operate. Not all 1911s will run them without modification. So let, let's see how they do. Bad flinch on that one. But she ran those aluminums really well, so I'm proud of her. <laughs> All right. Now, if we go ahead and look down range here, we can see it is hitting a little bit to the left and consistently, so we know it wasn't me. I did move it over to the right, and you can see I did hit a bullseye right there. Uh, so that's just something that you need to know. Um, this is one of SIG's higher end 1911s, so even on your, your nicer guns, you don't always know that those sights are going to be dead on. Uh, so we'll get a little uh, adjustment done back in the gunsmith room, and next time we bring her out, she'll be dead on. But uh, yeah, just keep that in mind. You know, test your products, you know, your tools, you, don't, you can't always count on, on them right out of the box. So this one here. Uh, we'll see how Jay does with it, but I'm thinking going to have to adjust that sight. But she's running beautifully, so I'm happy with it. <laughs> Let's give this to Jay and see how he does with it. See if uh, it's just me hitting off or if we need to adjust this. All right, guys. Got Seth's uh, Emperor Scorpion here. Got 10 rounds loaded up. We're going to see what's going on with this shooting to the left. I'm pretty sure it's not him. Never know. Oh, I'm sure. Here we go guys, 10 rounds. Let's see, all righty. Let's take a look down there and see what we got.
So yeah, you can see here, uh, got in under that bullseye, but we're all definitely tracking to the left. So yeah, I, I definitely say we need to uh, knock the sights over to the right a bit and she'll be fine. So that's nothing uh, bad or anything, nothing to down the gun about guys. Just to, sometimes, you know, uh, you have iron sights that need to be sighted in. As a matter of fact, uh, you know, Seth, um, you're really supposed to check them and sight them in. Everybody thinks they come sight. They get them close as they can for you on paper, but you're supposed to go back. But typically, they're they're sighted in. But no, good deal. That's good good grouping. Um, just need to be bumped over a little bit to the right. No nothing biggie. A sight, tool, a sight tool won't fix. Yeah, nothing a sight tool won't fix. All right, guys. Let's head on back down. Let's see how fast we can get 10 rounds out of this thing. Yeah. She runs smooth. We're gonna throw this round at Oliver just to, <laughs> he knows what we're yeah. going through. <laughs> All right guys, out here on the berm to give our final thoughts on the SIG Emperor Scorpion. Yep, uh, it's a, a great carry little 1911. Um, I know it, uh, some people gripe about these grips, chewing them up and you put a bunch of rounds through it. You know, you can feel a little bit of, you know, raw to it when you put a lot but uh man that's about my my gripe on it um what'd you think jay i'm in love with it <laughs> yeah. yeah i really like it uh i mean 45 can be in, in my opinion can be uh aggravating to shoot or they can be so pleasant and that can be that and that t typically is up to the quality of the gun you know how it's fitted and you know um and how it's sprung in my opinion and how the grips are it, it it's just one of those guns get off me uh, mosquito too cold that, for the uh, guys yeah it's just one of those guns that has to be that has to be done right when when you when it when it all works together it just it just it just flows seamlessly so um great job sig i mean it it does what it does the gun's accurate we need to tap these sights over so that's probably us um um, maybe knock them over I don't know or they were just a, a tad bit off that that's no big deal we'll we'll get that squared away but and good finish I, good good trigger I, I can't blame sig on on the yeah. sights either I don't yeah. it was a, a pre-owned firearm I got it yeah. from a good buddy yeah but uh, when they're they're back and forth and you can even see up here yeah on it uh, yeah but it is it a is, little yeah. bit yep over. there you go yep so mm -hmm. I think once we tap it in, uh, yeah. we'll, we'll put a short out. We'll show right. you guys how yeah. accurate they can be. But yeah. no, just a beautifully shooting gun. And yeah. I think they're very underrated on these fastbacks. People yeah. you know, laugh about it and yeah. all, but that little bit of curve there just really does fit your hand a lot better. Yeah. Um, I really like it, man. I, I don't really have, after shooting it too, I don't, I have zero knocks, but you know, I would, they do have them the, the, with the, uh, the full size, the full Emperor size Scorpion uh, with, does with the, have the, with, tactical, with the, the rail. tactical rail, but so. I don't even want. I don't even need a tack rail. On. I just enjoy shooting. I like the classic look. I, I like it. Um, I have zero knocks, but I love. It's really a pleasure to shoot. And the the 1911 guys out there that really love 1911s um, know that with all the new stuff going on and 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 uh, with firearms and ammunition. Um, People tend to go other ways, but um, if you're a 1911 fan like I am, um, you know what I what I mean when I say it's, it's truly a pleasure to, to to shoot it. It's it's an acquired taste. <laughs> yeah. Very 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 good job, Sig. I'm, I and, like it. And you guys out there that have have shot both, you know, full size versus the uh, officer's version, which is what this is, 4.2 inch barrel uh, over the 5 inch barrel. And then fastbacks. Let us know what y'all think. Also, you know, we got our own opinions. We want to know yeah. what you guys think. Also, so let us know if y'all shot both of them or just your thoughts in general. Hit us up. We'd be glad to know your your opinions as well. So until then, I think that about wraps it up for it. Thanks again, Sig. Great gun, and we love you guys. We'll see y'all soon. Make sure you hit that that uh, like button, share, subscribe, and bang that Smash notification. Smash it. We'll see you on the next one. Adios. <laughs>